Lillard from the corner for three. Won't go. And that'll do it. The Warriors do it again. Another comeback as they defeat the Blazers here in overtime and advance to their fifth consecutive NBA Finals. And for the first time ever, Toronto is heading to the NBA Finals. What chance do you give the Raptors to win this best of seven series? I give them a good shot. They are the underdog, but I give them a good shot. Can you get Golden State to miss shots the way you got Milwaukee to miss shots? That answer to me is no. Come on, we're on three. One, two, three. We're ready for this moment, fellas. Yeah, Let's go take what's ours. Just us. One, two, three. Just, Just us. us. Finals game, a 10 point lead at the half. Great communication, okay? Physicality right from the start. Let's put it on here at the third. Let's go. Raps, one, two, three. Raps. Pass deflected, knocked away. Three on two, Toronto. Siaka lays it up and in. Flips traffic down the lane. She's on the go. Got him with a one hander. And Steph Curry with another 30 point game. Siakam has done it all tonight for Toronto. Rebound, tucked up and in! Pascal Siakam with a 32-point game in his first appearance in the NBA Finals. The Toronto Raptors take game one. Here we go, let's go, let's go. All the shot, good effort. One, two, three, Raps. At the end of the day, they outplayed us. Like, there's... No other way to kind of say it. They did what they were supposed to do. It's game one. It's our first step. You know, Toronto, what they bring to the table. Uh, some of the best fans in the league, and we need them to be even louder on Sunday. What happened last night is the problem for Golden State, with or without Iguodala. Although with or without KD is a different story. I'm, I'm, this is without KD. With KD, it's unfair. Golden State's better than anyone. He just needs one or two of those guys that are like eight, nine deep to play well as they're devoting the whole defense to Kawhi, and they're going to win this series. You're listening to your home of the Raptors, Sportsnet 5 well, Raptors talk this afternoon. Playing in their first final. I thought they were more ready to go than Golden State. Yeah, that's how you knock off a giant. You got to have everybody having the confidence. The defending champs back on their heels. Now down one game to none in the finals for the first time ever and still without an injured Kevin Durant, can Golden State bounce back and even the series? Yes, sir. Locked in, ready to go. It's first to four, not first to one. So we're never going to doubt ourselves, no matter what position we're in. Get ready to run early. Okay, they're going to try to throw you the best punch early. Get ready to run early. Get it straight out the gate. Game two of the NBA Finals underway from Toronto. Bounce pass over to Clay Thompson. Thompson fumbled it, leaves it for Draymond. Back to Clay. Quick release and a splash. A three ball for Clay Thompson. 
Here's Clay on the other end. Three point line. Catch and shoot. Three. Good. He is red hot. We're going to start the game. Good start, guys. Our defense is much tighter. Let's get a stop and run. Plenty of time. Keep running. You just keep playing and you go get it yourself. McKinney turns it over. Van Fleet. Up top. playing with the force once again. Gasol has direct go. Great pop. Oh! Oh! With a slam dunk on the feet. Let's go! Let's go! Keep that pressure up. Keep that pressure up. Stolen by Van Vliet. One man to beat. Van Vliet to the basket. Lays it in. They don't pick it up. Kawhi with six to shoot, makes his move to the three-point line. Has it ripped away, it's loose at half court, chases down, Curry's got it. Curry behind Gasol, lays it around and in. Curry now with 14 points. They do a good job of hanging around. It seemed like in the last couple of weeks, Golden State's trailing every game. Again, it's a team that time and time again, they never overreact. Clay Thompson, quick release, and a splash! If you didn't think this Golden State team was going to go down fighting and put a run together, then you don't know this team. Raptors hanging on for dear life. Cuts to the cutting Clay Thompson, left hand finish. Cousins has made a big impact. Steve Kerr made a tough decision, and the big fella has rewarded that fate by making plays and getting it done defensively also. Cousins drives and finishes to Marcus Cousins now in double figures. What an avalanche here from Golden State. Cousins to Cook. Cook tries it. Knocks it down. Quinn Cook off the bench. Golden State leads by 10. We're going to go on a run of our own. Stay with it. Stay with it. We're going to go on a run of our own. Just regroup here a little bit. Keep playing. Okay. Cut a little harder. Work a little harder to get open. Let's go. Just get a bucket and a stop right here. Let's go. Leonard. Harassed by Green. Foul. Shots good and one. Raptors still alive. Five point game. Five point game, baby. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it right here. 33 seconds to play. Gasol taps it out. Siakam out to Green for three. Ah! Raptors down two. Do you foul or not right now? You've got to trap him to get it out of his hands. Curry throws it, Livingston has it. Back to Iguodala. Iguodala puts it up. Watches a three. Buried it! He buried it with 5.9 to go. Andre Iguodala with a game two dagger. The final horn goes, and the Warriors capture game two here in Toronto. It feels amazing, man. It feels amazing. And the finals are all even at a game of peace. You know, you got to come on the road and get a win. You know, it's always great to kind of relieve that pressure. Now we got to go home and take care of business. We're in the same boat they're kind of we're in coming here. You know, we got to go out there and get one. Right? That's all we got to do is get one. And uh, we can do that. That's what we came to do. We gotta take care of home court. Love Nation, get ready. Thanks. Trying to draw a foul here. Spreads his legs and lands awkwardly and progressively looks like it just starts to bother him more and more until finally on that last possession, he's calling for a foul. He can't go any longer. Before they did it, he made a three, and now he's in the back. Was last night more about Golden State or more about the Raptors? Be honest. It was more about the Warriors. Mm -hmm. um, you know, give those guys credit. This is, according to you, the best perimeter defender in all of basketball. Yeah. This is the best two-way player in but all I, the playoffs. But what I also told you. Okay. What did I also tell you? I don't know. Yeah, he uh, hurt the 10-9 oh, defender. Oh, now we got the injury excuse. That's what I've been trying to tell you. He did not limp one time last night. I didn't even see him wince or grimace last night. I don't well, know. They, Maybe they, I watched they, the wrong they, game. They,
We all just understand the moment. We're very locked in and focused on adapting, you know, to the circumstances that are thrown at us right now with, you know, a lot of injuries and kind of uncertainty of who's going to be able to play. Right now, it's possible five games left, and uh, you're sore, but um, you have to take your mind off of whatever pains that you have. You just lay it all out there. Game three of the NBA Finals. The mood's a little bit different. This is the most banged up the Golden State Warriors have been throughout their five-year run. Just got to pull together as a team. Let's do what we do. After playing in 120 consecutive playoff games, Clay Thompson will now tonight miss his first playoff action. In a lot of ways, this is the Raptors' best opportunity to take control of the series and to take home court advantage back. We gotta stay locked in, uh, mentally tough, mentally focused, and uh, full 48. When players don't talk about how much they want to win, they show you how much they want to win. Lowry and Curry diving, and a hell of a ball. They are fighting to the bloody end. Leonard, double team, double. Splits the double, gets it to Van Vliet. Toronto Raptors have taken home court advantage back. They come to Oakland and win game three. Hard work, hard work. Make sure we get our rest, get on, get our rest. And ready to go to work again. Make right. sure we get our rest, get on, get our rest. And ready to go to work again. All right, let's go. Raps, one, two, three. Raps. getting set to face the Golden State Warriors as Toronto comes into this game. A chance to grab a 3-1 series lead. Toronto isn't afraid of them. And a lot of teams, I think, when they get down to the Warriors in the past, have been. This team is not. It's a must win. Every game's a must win for us. That's how we feel, but tonight especially. Big game. Got to take it to them again on the road. A lot of intensity, a lot of passion to get this one. Perhaps a little more emotional for the Warriors and their fans knowing that this is the final season at this building. Warriors, come on now! Come on now. The Warriors want to square the series. Tonight, Golden State will get Klay Thompson back. Hey, Welcome to Game 4. Communication's gonna be great tonight. Get your defense set up. It's huge tonight, okay? Play with incredible composure. 48 minutes together. Outwork them. Put yourselves in position to win the game. Thompson, quick catch, posting up. No problem for Clay. And it's good to see Clay Thompson back on the floor. Curry, sidestep three. Right now, the Warriors playing at another gear. Leonard pull up triple far wing. Oh my, Leonard single handedly keeping Toronto in the game. He's put his arm around the collective team and said, Follow me, boys. Great intensity. Maintain the defensive intensity of the execution. They're flying around pretty good right now, but that's okay. You fly around with them. They're running hard. You run hard, too. Cousins to Thompson. Nice ball fake and an open jumper. Welcome back, Clay Thompson. Iguodala, Thompson blows up a three. Got it for the right sideline. You really can see how much Thompson brings to this team. 35-27 Warriors. Here's Lowry, feeds Siakam, rolling down the post and scoring on the lane. If I'm the Raptors, I am excited about where I am right now in this half. They're still hanging around this Warrior team. 
It's up our effort a little bit. The offense is pretty good. Step into your shots and start making some more, which is going to help our defense. I need everybody's energy up. Defensively, we're getting after it. Every possession, everybody rebound, and we go. All right. Here's Van Fleet pushing it. In transition, Kawhi lets it fly. And that ball played a little plinko before it fell down. Down one of the Raptors looking for their first lead of game four. Pulls the trigger oh, on boy. three and hits. Leonard knocks down another three. And the first lead of the night for the Raptors. Good job on offense. Hey, moving the ball. Keep in the open, man. And it's your quarter, so hey, get your energy up right now. Lowry, shot rejected by Andre, knocked it out of bounds. Shot blocked by Ibaka. Lowry up, blocked by Draymond Green. Some pace here in the third. Fred finds Kawhi over Thompson. He's got 31, 17 in the quarter. Nervous moments from the Oracle crowd. A huge third quarter for the Raptors. Keep attacking them, keep attacking them and be strong on your finishes in transition. Lowry dribbling with five, Lowry with three, inside Ibaka, turns, hooks, scores, and he's fouled! Serge Ibaka, big impact off the bench. This crowd is stunned. Ibaka to Lowry. Kyle Lowry has been the ultimate maestro in this second half. Back to Ibaka, but a slam! Ibaka has been special. Raptors showing such poise here in this hostile arena. Leonard, open three, knocks it down. The Toronto Raptors have won game four. They take two here at Oracle Arena. And now Golden State, one loss away from their dreams of a three-peat coming to an end. Not satisfied, got the job done, we got another one on Monday. Okay. Oh. Good team. Take them one at a time, forget what the score of the series is. Let's go. Let's go. Raps! One, two, three, Raps! Think about this. The Warriors just lost back-to-back -back NBA Finals games in their house. It's one of those nights where you play a lot of energy and start to build momentum, uh, and the wheels fall off a little bit. We got to do something about it if we want to you know, extend the series. They just do not have that element, obviously, to their offense. The big man is looming. We don't know if we're going to see him, but I'll tell you what, if he doesn't appear on Monday night, I do not think Golden State can win that game. Get back, get it. Here we go, let's get let's this. Let's get it. We got let's this. Get it. Being down three games to one in the NBA Finals is a daunting task for any team, but the Golden State Warriors aren't just any team. You can never underestimate the heart of a champion. You know we're going to get their best shot. we got to go out there and give them our best shot. All of a sudden, Golden State has a new addition. Kevin Durant will play, and Kevin Durant will start. Let's get it. Yes! Let's, go. Let's get it. Bring it up, bring it up. Nobody said it's going to be easy, but this group is built for this. Yes, sir. Let's go win one game and take it from there. Just yes, up. Man. Man. Yes, yes, sir. Sir. JJ! Oh. Passes out to Durant, who gets off a three and hits it! Kevin Durant back in the lineup and in the scorebook with a triple. Great job, fellas. Great job. Keep fighting. Here comes Toronto. Four on two. Kawhi down and finishes. Kawhi on the inside. And the Raptors down by one. Here comes Durant. Durant off the screen, takes a three. It's good for KD. What a start for Kevin Durant. 11 points. Ibaka trying to stay with Durant. Knocks it away and Durant slipping. His teammates going over to check on him. With a right lower leg injury. Livingston dribbles middle, bounce pass, Cousins goes up, takes the hit and scores. Well, he's had an impact here. Leonard blocked by Cousins. Boy, Cousins doing a little bit of everything. Cousins now, he'll try a three-pointer. State 
maintaining this lead because of the play of DeMarcus Cousins. Draymond gets it out to Curry, relocates, blocks way free. Good and a foul! A 13-point Golden State lead. Golden State down three. Iguodala to Curry. Curry takes a three, it's up and good! Curry has tied the game at 103. Curry behind the back, touch pass Draymond to Clay Thompson. Pumping, fly by. Three ball. Got it! Golden State retakes the lead. This game is absolutely insane. The drama, the oh. tension, the incredible play. Ten seconds to go. Down one. They go to Kawhi. Double team. Finds Van Vliet with two. Into the corner. Lowry for the championship. No! The game's over. The game is over. The Warriors have won. Three-peat dream is still alive. Keep the lights on at Oracle. Dust those seats off. You get to play another game. That's how we, we won. An inspiring performance from the Golden State Warriors. It's great. It's good to rally around Kevin. We did that for him, man. On the one hand, I'm so proud of them. Just the amazing heart and grit that they showed. And on the other, I'm just devastated for, for Kevin. two days we'll be suiting up in front of Oracle Arena with an amazing atmosphere and an opportunity to play for him. We're gonna have to will ourselves for another 48 minutes to stay alive. And I think we can rally. I'm not going to sit here and always point out the fact that Steph Curry in his entire career in the finals, I don't know why so few people are willing to say this. You know, I, I, I can run into Steph in the hallway like everybody else, and it does not feel good to run into the player when you say these things on the air about them because it feels like you're talking about their character or their heart in some way, and maybe in certain respects you are. Maybe in certain respects I am. But I tell you what I see. In his entire career, I've never seen Steph in a pivotal finals game, hit the big shot when his team needed it in order to overcome something, in order to win. Yeah, yeah, credit. Steph did come through, but I'm saying you're missing what enabled him to come through. The fact is he and Clay looked absolutely gassed until Nick Nurse caught the timeout that tired gave too. him yeah. a breather. Right. Kawhi looked tired they gave too. him a breather. They all looked tired. Also, all right. looks like a rookie mistake. They after that, that non-traveling call. They were yes. dispirited. That, that Steph three gave him spirit. Back against the wall. I think everybody in this organization believe, you know, if anybody can do it, we're more than capable. Everybody that steps out there takes some responsibility for it. History in the making as it's the final game in Oracle Arena. Tonight, they close the doors on the building the Golden State Warriors have called home for 47 years. to start. Lowry into the lane, kicks over on the side to Green, gives it back to Kyle. Lowry is free. Got it. Lowry can feel it. He fires a heat check three. He is on fire. Lowry gives it to Pascal. It's a three. The Raptors, you could not have asked for a better start. Thompson floats it in. Green floats it up. Slams it down. These two teams getting after it here in the second quarter. Keep playing. Keep playing. Get to your next action. Lowry into the lane. Stops on a dime. Another cut by Ibaka. Another dunk by Serge. Big boost off the bench for Toronto. Pascal gets by. Hands off to Kawhi. Foul in a bucket. A wild first half here at Oracle. Incredible first half. Steph and Clay doing good things. Andre Iguodala looking like he's 25 years old. Kyle Lowry playing the game of his life. 
over to Thompson, he'll dribble down the lane, goes up, protected the ball, and scores it! Spectacular bucket by Thompson. Game six, Clay at it again. To Clay Thompson, he'll pull up and fire for three, it's good! Thompson running the floor, and Thompson grabs his left knee. And everybody for the Warriors, and the franchise and everyone in the stands holding their breath. The report on Clay Thompson is that knee injury will keep him out and he will not return the remainder of the game. Hey, he's fighting. Keep going. Right? Stay aggressive. Everybody rebound. Take care of the ball. Okay? Cook finds Cousins. He finds Iguodala. Shot clock one. He has to put it up. Oh, the shot clock expires. What a big time player in the pressure games. Get him, stop and run. Get him, stop and run. Great energy. Great energy here. Let's go. Kicks out to Van Vliet. What a tough shot. Toronto, two and a half minutes away from a championship, much like they had in game five. Van Vliet. What a step back, and he drills a three. Big bucket, Fred Van Vliet. The biggest game of his life, and he is shining. This is the last game at Oracle. Will it be the last game of the NBA season? Cousins will power his way to the middle, goes up strong, finger rolls it up and in. That's a one-point game. What a game in game six. Oh, it's been absolutely fantastic. No fouls to give. Siakam drives, gets past Green, throws it up. Siakam with the bucket, he's got 26. Have we seen a finals with as many stories as this one, it's been incredible. 18 seconds to go, one point game, Toronto leads. Danny Green, tied up by Draymond, throws the ball away! It went out of bounds! He threw it away! Oh, and then will get the ball back with 9.6 to go, down by one! Toronto, they've been a great defensive team all season long. They need one defensive stop. An NBA championship on the line. Ligadala throws it to Green, who catches it. Back to Curry, puts up a three. basketball for this is what I work out for and I'm happy that my hard work paid off so hard this year, the ups and downs, injuries, new team, just to be able to come out and finish it off, man, it's unbelievable. Feels amazing. It's great. I love it. You gotta enjoy it. 
uh, Kyle Lowry, Toronto Raptors. Uh, Fred, how does it feel to be um, a world champion? Uh, it's unbelievable, man. It's unbelievable. Uh, yes! Yeah. You got it. I've been floating for the past hour. I uh, haven't touched the ground yet. I won't touch the ground in a couple days. <laughs> See where I'm from. From there to a world champion. God bless me. Thank you. It's a tough feeling, you know, being on this side of losing in the finals. We'll be thinking about this one. It, it's tough, but our DNA and who we are and, and you know, the character that, that we have on this team. We're really proud of the way that we fought to the end. We've had a lot of great memories in this building. Hopefully every fan appreciates the journey and the ride. And every fan that was watching turned the page to bigger and better things coming for this franchise.